All right, hello and welcome to this very first playthrough of The Messenger. Last time we played through the Underworld area, and now a lot of weird shit's happened, and we are... This is where we came from, right? Yeah, so... We're back in the Tower of Time. Okay, what's all this? Look, all I'm saying is he's been carrying the scroll for a long time already, and it could be dangerous. It is exactly as was foretold in the visions. A born-again messenger will master time itself and end the curse by fighting in two cycles simultaneously. What? I don't know. Warping one to go to the future was risky enough. You think he can sustain that constantly? Well, unless you want to carry the scroll again, I don't see what other choice we have. Besides, we really need to find the remaining music notes. Music notes? So you still believe the music box is important? Well, I am the prophet, right? So? So yes, I do believe in the prophecy. Well, if you really mean to help the messenger, try to tone that down that wannabe epic tone of yours. <clears throat> Careful, heathen. The myths of legends are very complex, and attempts to trivialize their meaning may cause... Whatever, I'll be in my shop. <clears throat> so, the Prophet will be your guide from now on. Good luck with that. <clears throat> the Prophet requires a moment of your time, Messenger. Okay, all right. <clears throat> and so, the Messenger rises once more. I'm not sure what I should do next. <clears throat> the mists of time are quite intricate indeed, but fear not, for the Prophet is here to unravel their meaning. More like the Interpret, then, am I right? <clears throat> I will forgive this affront, for these are troubled times. Behold, Messenger, as the Tower of Time's Portal Nexus activates to help you on your quest... Portal Nexus? Oh, can I go back to the other levels now? Return here whenever you seek guidance, and I shall provide. Godspeed! <clears throat> Behold, the music box. Legend says that it is very the very relic maintaining the curse on humanity. Okay. A music box? How many portals do we have? So, this one's closed. As foretold by the mist, this portal shall be open from the other side. Oh, okay. Other side. Other side. Okay, so I've got a uh, icy town one. I've got a. Uh... Oh, are these the ones that are these the areas? So are we going back to areas we've already been to? I don't know how I'm gonna do that with the videos then. Hey, you worked. Yeah, pretty neat. Things are probably going to get cryptic from now on with all this profit business, so you'll probably want to make extensive use of your map. My map? Your map, yes. I don't have a map. Are you kidding me? I'm telling you, I don't have a map. Okay, let me get this straight. We gave you a scroll. The fate of this whole world seems to hinge on it. We gave you a hero title relating to it. You carried it for days across countless perilous situations, even through time itself, and you never even bothered reading it? You're an animal. <laughs> Turns out the scroll was actually a map. Okay, great. Press the touchpad to open it. Time to explore and find new areas. Okay. Okay, so we are in Autumn Hills now. Under the Shroud of Night, Crimson Trees shelter a magic note ready to be collected. So this is a different kind of game now. Uh, under the Shroud of Night, Crimson Trees shelter a magic, magic note. So those are the checkpoints. What the fuck is that thing? Under the Shroud of Night, Crimson Trees... Oh my god! We never even went to the Forlorn Temple. <laughs> uh, Howling Grotto, Ghost Room, Searing Crags. 
the underworld. The glacial peak. Cloud ruins. This is all of them. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's all the videos. I'm just because I'm I'm thinking about how I split them up uh, with my thumbnails and my videos and everything. Okay. I'll be in my shop. If you have it, if you have the coin, I'll be happy to mess with the profit by pointing out the hints on your map. Be safe now. What does that mean? Is there something else I can... Okay, so how many notes are missing? Six? We need six, and there's six doors. Understand the prophecy. Maybe I can help. What the, did the prophet say? Under the Shroud of Night, Crimson Trees shelter a magic note. Haha, <laughs> really? The Prophet gets sillier every day! I'd be happy to mess with him by helping you, but I need 300 time shards to operate the scrying orb. Uh, no, I don't want to. Okay, so I'm gonna need- Oh, we've got more shit! Holy shit! We've got more stuff. HP plus one and potions now fully heal. Being one with body and soul, you are more resistant and benefit more from healing. We need 350 for that. Attack boost. By mastering patience focus, you can wait to passively charge your next attack, making it deal triple damage. And what's this? As a blue glow to rooms on the area map where you can shift between the past and future time periods? Well, this is a very different game now. Adds a counter on the world map for the amount of power tools left in each area. I don't care about that at all. Marks the location of all power seals on the area map. Okay, I don't hate that, but I'm not going to be going to get those power seals. We're not doing that. 350. We're going to have to get all these in order to get this, though. So, let's get this one first. 350. <clears throat> What's this way? Oh, you like the big portal? It's actually kind of scary. After years of research, I realized one of the items we need to recover is in the very future we are trying to prevent. If my calculations are correct, it should take you there, but in order to activate it, I would need a relic imbued with demon magic. The music box? Hey, it's you! I really missed that time when we did the thing! The others don't want to do it anymore. Welcome to the Tower of Time. I put it back into its headquarters far form after you beat the challenge. Which I had designed myself, by the way. If you want to replay it, let me know. You may have missed a few hidden things. What are you talking about? No. No. I don't even know what the Tower of Time challenge is. I don't remember what that is. I'll have to go back and look at the video or something. I don't know. I'm not going to do that right now, though. So that's Glacial Peak, that's the Underworld, that's Bamboo Forest, or whatever it's called, that's the Autumn Hills, that's the, uh, the mine thing, and that's, the, okay, alright, alright. Okay, so, Crimson... Whoa, whoa! This is different! Once the- wait, is it per room? Is it like- is it- Why is the prophecy already different? Once the bird returns to the nest, it shall learn the power of true sight. The fuck does that mean? Shit. 
I mean, we weren't here before, were we? Yeah, what is all this? We haven't been here. What is happening? Am I still looking for crimson trees, or what's up, man? I never found that. Oh, I didn't get the credit for that. God, I don't know what to do now. Um, careful. Yeah, this doesn't look familiar, but even uh, even if uh, honestly, even if we'd done this before, I'm not sure I'd remember. Crimson trees? All these trees are fucking crimson. Do I have to go back to the Tower of Time? Is that Am I, am I the bird and the, and the nest is the Tower of Time? I mean, I don't know what I'm doing now. Oh shit. I'm hoping I can just go, keep going, and and there's just going to be an item here, because these trees look pretty fucking red to me. Fuck. It's not like a secret thing where I've got to like jump down in one of these things or something. Please God, don't let it be something like that. Oh, fuck off! I mean, I, I don't have any idea what to do. Well, that's not true. I, if I'm just gonna keep going forward, because I don't think I've done this. And, uh... At some point... We'll either get to the end, or we'll find what we're looking for, I imagine. Or it'll end up in a dead end at some point. You know? I kinda liked how simple this game was. It's suddenly gotten a lot more complicated. I have mixed feelings about that. It's a cool idea, 
But there's like all this, but it's kind of throwing a lot at me. There's a time loop. I'm going back to these areas. I have a map now. I've got all these different abilities that haven't all really been explained to me yet. I'm feeling a little bit overwhelmed. about to be in the Forlorn Temple. Is there going to be a boss here? Is this where we fought the first boss? Probably. So this is, so now we're in the Forlorn Temple. Okay, but... Maybe the bird needs to go back to the nest. Oh, it's because I'm in the Tower of Time. Under the Shroud of Night, Crimson Trees shelter a magic note. So what should I do next? Once the bird returns to the nest, it shall learn the power of true sight. What the fuck that means? Give me a second. How much did um, how much did um, the guy say it was going to cost us? Three hundred scrying doodads or whatever for his orb. Okay, so I guess what we're going to do is we're going to go get 300 orbs. Bird nest. Where was there a bird? I don't fucking remember. Okay, so maybe what I need to do... Thanks for saving me earlier. I've been looking for my colleagues, Acro, Clostro, and Pyro. Okay, I don't know what that... I don't know what that is. Oh, this is gonna take us to the catacombs. Okay. So what's this? Back in NES land, aren't we? Okay, so this is just straight up the catacombs.
So I need to be doing stuff like that, maybe? I really don't want to have to pay him for a hint. This is interesting. What? I can't get back up this way. There's a. Yes, I want to climb up to the Forlorn Temple. Yes. Now I can see the difference. I'm having trouble understanding the prophecy. Maybe I can help. What's the prophet say? Once the bird returns to the nest, it shall learn the power of true sight. Um, hold on a minute. Hold on. Hold on a minute. If I go to the Forlorn Temple... Oh, shit. And I look at the prophecy... Let's go ahead and pay for it. I don't... I don't know... Maybe getting a hint once will give us a better idea of how this works. Oh, it was at the very first place. And we're out of money. Okay, great. Once uh, the bird returns to the nest. Okay, alright. Fuck me. Alright, that costs us 300 doodads, whatever, fine. Let's see if we can figure the next one out on our own. And there's no fast travel or anything, or... Ah! I really liked how simple this game was. I, I don't know how I feel about all this. Um. Fuck it. My, I just realized my security cameras jumped onto another screen that I can't see without turning the game off, so we'll just go without our security cameras for a bit. No! Close. Uh, yeah, I'm mildly annoyed. I'll get over it probably, but close. So instead of going the other way here, I should have gone left. Okay. Okay, fine. I want to go up. All oh, right, okay.
and make that three hundo back. So that's just automatically gonna happen no matter what. Alright, we're almost there. I remember this area now. Does it matter whether it's SNES land or NES land right now? Okay. Our champion returns! How is adventure treating you? A little bit harder than I thought, but the music is amazing. <laughs> That's exactly right. You left too soon, I should have taught you the power of true sight! True sight? It is a technique seldom taught to young students such as yourself! Unless the mind can be expanded, that is. How can I expand my mind? A warm cup of astral tea will do that! Unfortunately, we ran out of astral leaves a few years ago. All we have is a single seed, but fully growing it would take centuries! Give me the seed, I'll see what I can do. I was hoping you would say that! You got the astral seed. Now to find a flower bed and wait a few centuries. Okay, so now I need to find a flower bed. Oh, but I need to plant it in the old time, right? So yeah, we need to stay in this area. Okay. I need to find a flower bed. I'm gonna start at the very beginning. What if it's right here at the beginning? I don't know. This is the very beginning of the game. Can't go any further than that. Alright, good. Now, if I check the prophecy now, under the Shroud of Night, Crimson Trees shelter a magic note ready to be collected. Why does it say there's a door above me? Crimson Trees. And will that change if we go to the Crimson Forest?
I'm not even 100% sure these trees are red, but they I believe they probably are. Under the Shroud of Night, Crimson Trees shelter a magic note ready to be collected. Still need six music notes. Crimson trees shelter a magic note, ready to be collected. Under the Shroud of Night. Ah, shit. So... It's nighttime. Crimson trees shelter a magic note ready to be collected. Oh shit. Do I want to even... No, I don't, is the answer. I do not. I still don't understand why it was giving me that note, that uh, hint before, depending on where I was. That didn't make any sense to me. I mean, it's night everywhere here. There are crimson trees everywhere. So I'm, I'm expecting to see a prompt or something, like a be up prompt when I can interact with something. The only other thinking is I, I thought it was going to be during the, the four times because they said I had to plant the seed first, but is that even the same thing? Is that, are those hints, things, two things related? I don't know. Probably would be my guess. But I don't know. Excuse me. Oh, I didn't even see myself. Oh, I don't wanna fuck that up. I didn't get that last time. Because I don't remember doing this. I'm... Uh, I know it's it's not the game's fault, because this game has been amazing. And the fact that they're adding complexity is never a bad thing, really. Um, but I, I don't like this game as much. 
as the original game I was playing. I enjoyed the simplicity of it. Now, I, when I liked it, it was like, go to the area, finish that area, move on to the next area. Now we're going to all the areas. Now it is more of a Metroidvania. Now it's a Metroidvania, and I don't... I, I, I was enjoying just playing a 2D platformer. I, I play a lot of Metroidvanias, and they're fine, you know, but I, I, I don't know. I wasn't really feeling a Metroidvania. I'm a little miffed that I'm playing a Metroidvania now. It's not the game's fault, it's just... My expectations have been subvert, subverted in a way that I don't really... It's off-putting to me. I'll get used to it. I don't know where to go. Doing a lot of fucking... Doing the same area over and over again. Okay, so... What's that? What's that yellow thing? Maybe that's where we need to go? Oh, it's 350. We're seven short. I thought it was 325. Oh, I could have gone back through that portal and come right back here. Okay. Alright. It's fine. It is undeniably cool to have a standard uh, 2D platformer just turn into a Metroidvania. That's what they've done here. Uh, that is cool. It's just not exactly what I'm going to move for right now. idea of, like, backtracking and shit. Yep, we were here 20 minutes ago. So let's see what this yellow thing is, or whatever that color is. Is that different color a different area? Or what? God damn it. So, this is what's going to happen. We're going to get back to the end of this like we just did. And we're not going to know what the fuck to do. And we're going to be fucking lost again. And we're going to have to pay another 300 for another hint. 
Is that how we're gonna get through this game? Just one hit at a time? Look, crimson tree, look, here, look, can I just plant it? If, I, if there was a way to, like, go into my inventory and use an item... Oh, for Christ's sake. Can I use that item? Is there, a, like, an... I use items? No. So I just need to... I probably passed where I need to go, but I was in the wrong time period or some shit. So how do I change it? So if I do this... So now we're in the NES time. So now maybe there'll be an option somewhere. Uh, maybe I'll be able to get to that area. That could be. Maybe I'll be able to get to that area now, because the, the routes are different down here. Yes. Yes. Oh, but we did this. That was dumb. I'm gonna die now. What's this? Oh yeah, there's- I remember seeing this before. You can go down there, but I can't- I don't have a... an ability. Okay, so I guess we're gonna go back and pay for another fucking hint! I don't know what else to do. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe there's, um... Alright, hold on. this, is it? No. I'm hoping there'll be an up prompt when I get to wherever I need to plant this thing or what, need to interact with something. But God knows, man. I don't fucking know. Alright.
So how do I get down there? Some ability we don't have yet or something. Alright, I've been through the entire area. This is a nice big tree. fuck I'm doing. Yeah, what are these? I guess I'll go pay for another fucking hint. I don't know what else to do. So is this what we're gonna have to do, is just pay for a hint every time? That's probably... Okay. Probably we were in the later land, the future, when we were there and we couldn't get through that. I don't know. Okay, so for future reference, we need to check the, the gateways that are, are, that are showing open, even though we still don't appear to be able to get into most of them. Like, I've tried three or four already, and it's just... Nope, you just can't get through. Get out, out. Oh, God. What? Oh, shit. Oh, wait a minute. Can I even... Oh, okay, I can. Okay. Wait, can I? Can I do this? I can. Okay, alright. Excuse me. Um, excuse me. Oh, for fuck's sake! Oh, I'm starting to have- I'm, well, this is gonna actually gonna maybe be a problem. Like... I'm, I'm- I'm starting to get frustrated. I really, really liked this game the way that it was. What do I do now? Fuck off. Give me a minute.
All right, I'm sorry. Uh, I expected this video to take, you know, 45 minutes or so because that's how long all the areas were, have been so far. And now we're doing all this backtracking shit. And honestly, man, I get what they're after and it's not, object it's not like it's objectively bad or anything, but I am hating this. I don't like this. I don't like... I, I don't want to play this game. I, I, I liked the 2D platformer. I it, The game has changed on me. That's crazy. I bet a lot of people really liked that. That it's suddenly, oh, it's a much more complicated game now. It's a, it's a Metroidvania suddenly. Oh, I love Metroidvanias. Yeah, I like Metroidvanias are fine, but I was... Really liking the, the 2D platformer and the with this whole, like, hint system with these fucking prophecy whatevers. Don't do that shit to me. I just want to know where to go. I need to know what to do. And now, now I know where to go and I can't figure out how to fucking get there. So what do I do here? Do I have to go back and, to, and get back into SNES land and then come back? I guess I do. I guess I do. But then, doesn't... But then won't I have trouble getting to where I'm supposed to go? Or planting the seed or whatever the fuck I'm supposed to do? So right now I gotta go back for what? We're doing this area for the third time? I'm, I'm not enjoying this. And I realize I'm being a little bit of a baby, but I just... I just don't like this. I liked the way it was. So... What were you meant? What's the map? And there's no way for me to. Oh, for fuck's sake! I. I don't know what to do. I. I guess I'm gonna try to fucking. I was right about where the, the area that it's in, so I guess they're hopefully they're gonna be in like chronological order from when you played them. So oh okay, so So why are we suddenly in Super Nintendo World? I mean that's okay, that's what I wanted. But is that gonna happen automatically? Get me the fuck out of here. Okay, so here we are. We're in Super Nintendo World. I'm just gonna call it the future from now on. Okay, so there's just a little gap here. But now... We're close. We were just here a little bit ago, but whatever. Okay, so... That's what I want, though, right? That's good, right? That's probably good, right? Because we want to be in the... We want to be in the past to plant the, the bullshit, right? And now here's a way that I can switch back and forth. Oh, I'm not sure I noticed that last time. Okay. Uh, am I supposed to act like all this is super cool that we're changing? Because I'm over it.
Okay, alright, so I should have been able to figure this place out on my own. I recognize that. Uh, now, but now I'm, I'm getting a better idea of... What is this? Okay. Oh, for Christ's sake, it's, is it a whole area? Are we going through a whole new area? Great. So it's a fucking puzzle platformer now. Uh, okay. So I guess maybe we'll stop after we get each one of the notes. Because there's six. Yeah, we got a ways to go on this game. Kind of would have been fine if it had just, like, that it had ended at the seven hours or something we'd already played. You got the key of hope. Materialized from the repeating intentions of countless villagers wishing for their messengers. Well, over past cycles, it's where the notes need to create a melody that will break the curse. Now what? Fuck am I? Okay, so how do I get back? There's a door up here. We'll make it work. We'll make it work.
Wait, what was that? What's that? Ah, yes, the jukebox. Jukebox? Silly name, huh? I brought it back from one of my journeys through time back in the day. I'm not sure what it's for, but the show looks pretty cool. So what happened to the cabinet? Oh, I teleported it somewhere else since we didn't need it anymore. Where is it now? That's something you may or may not find out later. And unlock the jukebox. Play your favorite tune in the shop or access it. I don't care. I don't care. Let's go turn in the ju the note and then we'll be done for today. Yeah, I'm not going to have time to play again. It's way longer than I expected it to. I mean, I guess it's only been an hour, but... <clears throat> As fate would beautifully have it, only by creating a melody from the crystallized forces of this world can the curse be broken. To complete the melody, we still need five music notes. Yeah, 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 I didn't click on it again. So what should I do next? <clears throat> Where the dead live, a foe-turned-friend left an important item. Where the dead live, a foe-turned-friend left an important item. So that sounds like the underworld. And the dragon, maybe, right? Oh, that was in the cloud ruins? Alright, we'll figure it out next time. We'll figure it out tomorrow. Alright, we'll see you then. Appreciate you.